Oh yes. Oh yes. <laughs> Bill, try natin yung Garo one aiming. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, I'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. Grab your one. Details. But every time I think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. So, so sorry, I'm having a hypothetical because of Pound Dark FPS. Yeah, what? I'm walking under a brilliant night sky through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth, waiting for know. me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. That was the restroom on that day. <laughs> so weird. And for a moment, I feel whole. Hello, guys. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. But it never lasts. Thanks, let me. Oh, it just happened. I'm always left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. What does she say? No, Pobedo mess. Oh. Varl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well. Consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? It must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually, but, um, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood.
Okay. But if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, <laughs> I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Wo denn da bin ich im Fokus? <lacht> Shall we? <lacht> All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. Oh, nice. Get to the cross. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Oh, your machines. Most dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? Focus can help us. What is that? It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. Nice. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. <laughs> and pull it out. That could work. Nice, nice, nice. Good thing in Focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. Humans, Homo sapiens, us. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now, yeah, Far right. Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our governments abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. The space? A serious system. There, we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, <laughs> the form of immortality <laughs> is data corrupt because the playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well... Yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Oh. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For their colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member yeah, recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. Uh, reactivate more.
Yeah. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? Well, we here at Far Zenith believe escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now you've seen what we're building here. <laughs> Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, that's yeah, right. Well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There it is. There. The backup. It should be stored in there. How do you know? Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. Hey, okay, what the, the heck? Oh, I'm borrowers. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Mm, stealthy thing. Stealthy, stealthy. Hmm. Let's see. And zoom. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Prawl. We look alike because... We're the exact same. Genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup? is like a set of instructions it's more than that it's called gaia and for a long time she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself so she made me to bring her back i'm the only one who can and this place is my last hope 
You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Thoral. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? That's all we learned. Oh, ho. Oh, dito sa to. Oh, grabe. Scorpion thingy, snakey thingy. Ano? Oh, dami. Tatlo. Three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osram, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? I'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy! Trust me. And there she goes. <laughs> nice. Ha! Huh, take that. There is a lama lama. Bellawa, smear my teeth. The boss fight. Um. No, 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 no. Oh, no. no. For this. Yes, language. <laughs> Aloy language. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, sorry. Finishing this the hard way. Oh, ma'am. Take that snake guy. <laughs> 